Hi, welcome to my channel 3D Multimedia. Under the NLP series, today we'll be learning tokenization. So in NLP, tokenization is the process of breaking a given text or paragraph into individual words or sentences. So now these words are referred as tokens. So a word is a token in a sentence and a sentence is a token in a paragraph. Okay, for example, I have a sentence like I was born in Africa. Now each word in this sentence are referred as token. Okay, so before moving into tokenization process, first we are supposed to know what is NLTK. NLTK is nothing but it's a natural language toolkit library which is used for text processing. It's free and it's, it's a free open source library for advanced NLP processing in Python. Okay, it has two methods word tokenize and sentence tokenize. This word tokenize it helps us to divide a given text at word level and Similarly, the sentence tokenize helps us to divide a given text at sentence level. Now, let us import the NLTK library. So before importing an NLTK library, make sure that you have installed NLTK library. To do the installation, okay, type pip3 install NLTK. And once the installation is done, you can import NLTK library. Okay, we need a package called punkt to do the tokenization. Here the NLTK NLTK tokenizer requires punk, punkt package. The punkt package in NLTK refers to punkt tokenizer. The punkt tokenizer is a part of NLTK's data distribution. So you can type as NLTK dot download punkt in, in single quotes. Okay. So apart from that, if you want to install some any other packages which you want to use further uh, in NLP, you can type this line. NLTK dot download all which will install all the other required packages. But as for the tokenization process, punkt is enough. Okay. Okay. So let us import the word tokenize and sentence tokenize function from the NLTK tokenize. So once you have imported it, okay, I have typed a sentence like hi, this is Jai, how are you doing? And stored it under the text. So I'm applying the word tokenize towards this particular text and each of the word along with the symbols are considered as a separate token so you can see a comma even the full stop is considered as a separate token here and at the sentence level so you can see that there are two sentences starting with hi and ending with j is considered as the first token and the next token starts from how and ends at doing so there are two tokens here for the, as far as the for the sentence tokenized okay so now let's consider a small paragraph so here this paragraph consists of three sentences okay so i'm going to apply a sentence tokenized towards this sentence you can see the first sentence that is the first word in this sentence that is natural and it and the ending of that word is language you can see so the first token it starts and it ends at the language and the new token starts from nlp similarly uh, you will be having three sentences in this paragraph. So uh, that is for the sentence. So it means three tokens are there. Okay. Coming to the word tokenize, you can see that here each word will be taken as or it will be considered as a separate token. Even this open bracket of NLP and close bracket of NLP will also be considered as a separate token. Okay. So if you need this, if you need this Google Colab notebook, you can comment in the comment section okay don't forget to subscribe to channel 3d multimedia thank you